Uh, hi, folks. Um, a question that I get uh, every now and then is, how do we get started given where we are with our data? So, I mean, we have, we have thousands of customers, and they, they live in varying degrees of what I would call data maturity. So we have folks that um, only use spreadsheets as their data source, and I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put them on one side because there's a lot more that you can do with your data structure uh, other than just spreadsheets. We have a ton of people that are using APIs to get data out of various services and applications. And then there's you know, folks that have warehouses uh, and you know, even semantic layers as well. So where your data lives is, is where you are in the whole data maturity curve. Now, ap applying power metrics or building metrics on top of that, we will meet you where you are. So whether we're going to define a metric based on a spreadsheet data source or a semantic layer, uh, or a warehouse or an API, it doesn't, it doesn't matter. For the end user, and, and this is what's ultimately important, for the end user, the metric is the metric. It doesn't matter if it's coming from a spreadsheet or a warehouse or something else. As long as that metric is defined, the calculation is defined, the definition is, is known, that metric is what is important to them. Where the data comes from, it doesn't matter. And furthermore, if you, if you want to move up in the maturity um, stage, so if you want to go from an API and finally your, your data is inside of a warehouse, the metric can stay the same. You repoint it to a different data, data source, so an API to a warehouse in this case, and the metric and the business end user really has a seamless, beautiful experience. Their metric doesn't change, even though the underlying data architecture or data structure uh, does change. So keep that in mind. Uh, we, can, we can build metrics and benefit the end users in a, in a stable environment, no matter where you, you are in your data journey. And as you mature through that data journey, we can sort of grow with you. And again, the end users have that stability of knowing that their metrics are always the right metrics. So let us know what your experiences are. We're always interested to hear about where you are in that journey. Um, let us know and drop me a line.